The first thing you need to do when building an animated wipe is make sure that all the keys are turned off. Next, select the macro button. Then on the stripes LCD, make sure you're in the macro tab and click record a new macro. After clicking record, select one of the blank macro buttons. Make sure that the macro button you selected is blinking. The first step is to turn on key three. Now it is time to assign the image store to key three. The first thing you need to do is press and hold second shift and key three. Once you have pressed the second shift in key three, then choose image store one. That will assign key three to image store one. Now it's time to set up your image store. The first thing you want to do is click on image store, image and movie. Once that is done, the next step is to choose image store one, the clip you want to play, cue to beginning and then play. After you have your image store set up, click the macro button on the stripe again. Then on the stripes LCD, click insert a delay. After clicking insert delay, you will notice timing now appears below the macro buttons. Choose one second. Then press the insert delay button again to exit the settings. Now click the cut button to insert a cut. Once you have inserted a cut, Click the insert delay button again. This time choose nine frames. Then press the insert delay button again to exit the settings. And last but not least, remember to turn off your key. Then click stop recording and test your new animated transition. The first thing you need to do is make sure all the keys are turned off. Then you need to select the macro button, then select record. Then select one of the blank macros to record to and make sure the light is blinking. The next step is to turn on key three. Once that is done, we're now ready to set up the image store. Press the second shift, key three, and then image store one to assign image store one to key three. Now let's go to the image store and set up the image store. Select image store, make sure you're on image, movie, then select image store one, then click the clip you want to play, then press Q to beginning, then play. Press the macro button again, then click insert a delay. You will see the macro line change to give you timing, select a one second delay, then select insert delay again to deselect it, click cut, then click insert delay again, this time, choose nine frames, then select insert delay again to deselect it, turn off the key, and then click stop recording and play your macro.